We're at the Ironman World Champs in St. George with Sam Long's Pro Bike. We're here in St. George with one of the favorites, Sam Long's bike, and he's riding the brand new Trek Speed Concept disc version. Uh, and it's a pretty good bike. It looks uh, quite the vision in pink. Obviously, Sam loves his pink. Yo, yo, yo. Okay, so let's take you through the bike and what he's chosen specifically for this race in St. George. Starting with his rear wheel, which is a disc. You obviously can't use discs in Kona, but you can use discs here in St. George. And he's told us he will definitely be riding the disc regardless of the wind conditions, which is interesting because yesterday it was pretty windy. He may, however, swap out the front wheel, the DT Swiss ARC 1180 millimeter for a slightly shallower 60 millimeter if it is looking like it's going to be very windy, but he will be riding the DT Swiss ARC 1100 disc on the rear. The components he has is the SRAM Red ETAP Axis, uh, and he's gone for a 1033 cassette on the back, which is definitely going to be needed. Although the hills are not particularly steep, there are some quite long ones. Uh, on the front though, he's gone for one by and a size 54 tooth. So he's got a 5410 combination for those long, draggy downhills with a tailwind. Let's hope that's enough, uh, enough teeth for that, uh, enough gear ratio for that fast descent because there's gonna be long periods of him going really fast. He's got 172.5 millimeter cranks, which obviously he's quite a big guy, so that's short for him. And he's paired that with a Speedplay Zero Pedals from Wahoo, which he's actually got the aero caps on underneath. So only one-sided entry, but obviously saving a half a watt or so with those aero caps on the bottom. Also noticed he's got the ice friction chain on, but there's not much uh, ice friction coating left on it. This is clearly an old one that he's still riding, but he's gonna be upgrading that and adding a brand new one with uh, all the lube on it for race day those extra watts might make all the difference. And as for the tires, you may have noticed the tan sidewalls. These always divide opinion, but I'm a fan. Well, these are actually from Schwab. They're the Pro 1 TT, but a prototype version of them. We're not sure what's new about them, whether it's a new compound or a thinner tire. What we do know though, is Sam is running a 25 millimeter in the front and a 28 millimeter in the rear, which seems about standard for this race. And then looking at his hydration choices, notably there's no bottle behind his butt. Uh, there is a fairly large aero bottle. I'm not sure how much it holds, but it holds quite a lot of fluid in there. The difficulty with that, of course, is that you can't refill that on the go. He's partnered that with a bottle between his arms. Also, not the aero bottle that comes with a speed concept, uh, because probably he's gone with the 51 Speed Shop aero bars. Uh, he, however, has a normal bottle cage on there. That bottle cage looks like an X-Lab Gorilla, which has got really good holding power, so your bottle doesn't eject, uh, but he has taken the branding off that, so I'm not 100% sure that that's what it is. Talking of the aero bars, Sam has the 51 Speed Shop bars angled up using a tapered riser underneath, bringing his hands pretty high. And between those, he has the Wahoo Element Bolt customized in Sam's trademark pink with a yo 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 catchphrase underneath. All in all, this looks like a pretty fast bike and a pretty good setup. And Sam Long is going to need a fast bike for this because as we know, he's gonna come out the water a little bit behind the guys, but I do think we'll probably see him catching up quite a few of the guys, if not all of them, on the bike. Interesting also to notice this little sticker on here. It's IOG, which stands for Ivan O'Gorman, who is world famous bike fitter in Boulder, Colorado. Clearly, uh, Sam Long has been dialed in by one of the masters themselves. So we look forward to seeing Sam Long smashing up the bike course on this bike on the weekend. It's a pretty good looking bike. Yo, yo, yo.